Before I begin today's video, I just want to say a quick thank you for the amount of support shown in my last video. It truly means a lot and I hope I can make more content that you guys can enjoy. Now, if I'm being realistic here, I don't think I'll get that kind of reception from a new video again anytime soon. But hey, you know, maybe down the line. We'll see. But anyways, so I know I'm a little late to the party here. Unfortunately, this got released when I was sleeping and I had to go to work in the morning. So I really couldn't put out a video early in the day, but better late than never, right? So they don't really show too much new stuff from the latest stream. Just about two crafts from Hime and Zen. So let's just take a quick look at it. Kind of guess what they are and kind of predict what they could have for the game. And a little bit more predictions about, you know, these characters. Okay, so let's start with Hime. All right, and here's one of her crafts. All right. Now, in regards to this craft, I think this is the same craft that she used back in the Hajimari episode that she appeared in. And I believe it was called Twin Shadows or something like that, which would make sense considering she has another shadow, right? So my line of thinking here is that it's probably the craft that she used there. Now, on that same note, I'm thinking if Reen is not a playable character in Calvert for at least probably the first game, if there's a second game, whatever, and Hime is probably more than likely just a guest character. She's probably not going to be a permanent member or anything like that, simply strictly a guest. I wonder if we're going to probably see her side of the story from the Hajimari episode. Because in the Hajimari episode, we saw it from Reen's perspective. So what if we see it from her side instead? That would be really interesting. Okay, now for Zen, that's his normal attack. And one of his crafts here. Okay. Now I'm pretty certain that should be his Thunder God kick. The jump isn't as over-exaggerated like in back in Trails in the Sky, but you see the lightning, you see the kick, it's probably another take on Thunder God kick. Now, since I didn't mention it last video, this is definitely Hime doing the Helix Strike. And Zin over on this one, I'm pretty sure he's just doing Smite. Now, I'll probably put up a video showing all of Zin's crafts, if you guys don't really remember what they were. Now, if we're assuming Zin's crafts are indeed going to be Smite and Thunder God kick, what do you guys predict is going to be his other crafts? Now, me personally, I believe he's going to have a buff. So it's probably his composure skill of sorts. And another one of his crafts would probably be one of his S crafts. Now, if he's getting the same treatment as the characters from Sky and Crossbell that reappeared in CS4 and Hajimari, one of his S crafts should indeed become a regular craft. And I would assume that would either be Disable or Oral Blast. I think Oral Blast would probably be cooler, but realistically speaking, I think it's probably Disable. Maybe, or maybe both. As far as his actual S craft goes, I would guess it's probably... It's most definitely got to be Wrath of Gembu, right? It has definitely got to be Wrath of Gembu. Okay, now we got those two out of the way, we can move on to some more showcasing of the main cast. Starting off with the Va Vaughn or Van. Okay, pretty standard crafts. Nothing too fancy here. And a little bit more of Agnes's crafts again. We've kind of already seen this, so not really much to comment about. And now we have another look at Aaron.
And we have a better look at two of his crafts. Pretty neat. Now for Fairy, we got a, a better look at her here. Her gun transforms into a little bit of a sword. Pretty cool. Gun AoE. Alright. Now one thing... While I was editing the last video, one thing I kind of noticed was how both Fairy and Randy's, you know, gun weapons also retract into blades. Which is something kind of really neat that I noticed. But take that information how you will. Alright, and another look at reset. I don't think we have seen this one yet. Support craft. And one of our offensive crafts. Damn, that looks really cool. Wait, that's your pose? Show me that again. I like how she twirls her gun around. It's really neat. God, that's really cool. I'm looking forward to using her. And now Quatra is optical cannon craft. Yeah, his beam, the little line beam craft. And some more field play featuring what he set. Yeah, no transitions at all. This straight up goes into the fight. and just run whenever the hell you want. But that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Consider subscribing if you haven't already, and maybe also consider giving this video a like if you enjoyed what you saw. All my socials will be in the description below, so consider checking them out. That'll be it for this video. I'll see you guys next time.